All right. Okay, ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So three, two, one, we'll click on the link. Okay. Yeah, okay, three, two, one. Mm, I don't know about this. It's like I'm looking at a totally different dude. They said it was going to be like an evolution, but this seems like more than an evolution, you know? I, I know. This is like, like he's in there. Like, I, like he's yeah. in there. I could see him. What? Like, if you said this was his cousin, I'd be like, yeah. yeah. Okay. I can see that. But if I met him and you had not said to me that's his cousin, I'd be like, he's this sticker. You know what I mean? Like, I'd be like, this guy's, this guy's like, He's like an imposter. Like he's this, this dude thinks he looks like the fanatic. Okay. Um, what's different? Like, okay. Uh, nose too short. A. Nose is way too short. Um, he's skinny. He's like skinnier. Like, okay. What was that like meeting? Was that like, Oh, let's all meet in conference room B and have a discussion about the fanatic's weight. Like, excuse me. Why are they fat shaming the fanatic? Nobody ought to be shaming the fanatic. Now, okay, let me, I will like to say, if this was his choice, if this was like his right. choice, like, okay, right. we have to support it. Yeah. I just like, that's not the vibe I get off of, off of this whole thing. Yeah, I don't feel like he went to the mascot doctor and he was like, what do I need to do? You know right. what I mean? Yeah. I feel like I feel like this was somebody else's idea. Totally. Yeah. Totally. I hope he's not changing for somebody else. Okay, what else? Well, he's married. Yeah, he is married. Oh no, is he having an affair? No, he's not married. <laughs> <laughs> is he married? He does, he does have a family. He's not married. He's got his, his mom, Phoebe Fanatic. Right. And then every once in a while there's like a little kid fanatic. Okay. Is Phoebe Fanag the one that dresses like the Queen of England? Yeah, that's right. Okay. That's his mom, Phoebe. Okay, okay. So he's got he's a different color, like a totally different shade of green. It's like a different he's like furrier. Yeah. Right? I gotta say I don't mind that part. No, he looks like lush, you know what I he's mean? Like more lush, like he's taking his omega threes. Okay, his like, laces are different. This blue tail and the the eyebrows are like more pronounced. Yo, I hadn't. Yo, I don't understand why his eyebrows need to be pronounced like that. You can't see his pretty eyes. I will say though, like as you get older, especially for men, like your eyebrows do get crazier. Okay, I don't want to. Okay, if that's what this is, I don't want to be seen as. Yeah, like, I mean. Either. Like, look, you can still trim them. You know what I mean? You don't have to let them, like, go crazy. That's true. And they do have, like, physical therapists on the team that could That's trim right. eyebrows. That's right. Um, blue, blue tail? Wait, what? I don't see. What his the tail? He's got, like, a blue tail. tail. Blue? Why the hell would you make his tail blue? What's that, like? Do you know what I thought this was? I thought it was maybe, like, he was going to look look a little different for spring training right like you know sometimes he's red like there's one day where he's just red right and i thought like oh, okay maybe you know look he's a he's a creature he's going through some sort of molting process or whatever because he's sure. been in hibernation or what have you and like okay so maybe he starts off in spring training he's got like a blue tail and the eyebrows are crazy and then like as he goes on he's like he settles down right but they're, they're making it seem like this is how it's going to be. That is how they're making it seem. Like, I guess I would be impressed if, like, over time something changed. I mean, I wouldn't. You know, when you think of filth, you think green. You know what I mean? That's, yeah. like, that's like our color. Right. But the blue, like, is he going to be slowly turning blue over time or something? I mean. I don't like that at all. It's like they're not giving us enough of, as fans. They're not giving us enough information, and like, I it's just like you don't like you see somebody and you like know them, and then they're changing, and it's just hard. His his shoes are different. Are you okay? 
it's shoes are just shoes. You know what I mean? And it's like, you know, sometimes he can wear different clothes and that's, and that's fine. Like sometimes he wears like the, the old school Jersey, you know, or whatever. Right. Let's not get hung up on the shoes. Okay. You know, there's, there's like, I, I, I just don't want you to be more upset than you need to be. Cause believe me, it's worth getting upset about. I'm not, right. I'm not thrilled with this. You know, I right, just don't want like, why do you get to decide how upset my level of upset? Okay. I'm not trying to decide how upset you get. I'm trying to, I'm trying to be nice. And no. I know, I know. Look, this is it. This is it's stressful. This is stressful. It's, you know? it's stressful, and it's, we shouldn't take it out on each other. I I do. We have to thank Jim Salisbury for preparing us yeah. for this. But like, I guess it's like everything was going fine. It's like, it's like you're having like a nice a nice day down the shore, a nice weekend. Yeah. You know, you go to church on Sunday morning, then you get some donuts, and then you hop in a car, and there's like no traffic going home. Everything's fine. Atlantic City Express, I whatever, get on 76, and then like boom, out of nowhere for no reason, overturn tractor trailer with, you know. Un- unnecessary game for delay like unnecessary it's like let's say you're walking down south street right and you're like you know what i haven't been to gyms in a while i'm gonna go in there and then you order a whiz wit and then what you get is like what everybody else thinks a cheesesteak is where it's like provolone and mm-hmm. green peppers on it right you know what i mean that's yeah. like what this feels like to me yeah no that makes a hundred percent sense like that's a beautiful way to say it. I, I can't agree more. Because the fanatic, they try to tell us like, oh no, he's evolved over the years. And it's like, did he? Like, I don't remember seeing that. Right. I mean, like maybe his opinions have evolved. Like maybe his opinion on like gay, you know, same sex marriage or, right. or like charter schools or something. Maybe that like thinking has evolved, but even that. Cool. Even that bothers me kind of because it's like it makes me think that the fanatic used to be more closed minded. And I don't like that. No, you're right. You're right. I should not have even been brought. No, I don't blame. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's it's, this is what they're doing to us, like putting these thoughts in our in our minds, because if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Right. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Like, also, there are massive legal issues with the people that created the fanatic and the team. That's neither here nor there. I, I'm just, I just want to say, like, this This is my final thoughts on this. Okay. Big mistake. Yeah. They, sh- they shouldn't have done it. Right. I love the Fanatic no matter what. No matter what. Fanatic's Fanatic. I'm all, I don't blame him, but I'm not going to forget this, you know? Right. I'm not going to forget this. No, totally. Like, it does make me feel more, like, jumpy, like, what's the next change going to yeah. be? If he's happy, but I will say again, I will reiterate, if he's happy, like, more power to him. Uh, but like you were saying, that's not how they're making it seem. So, no. like, you know, God bless him or whatever, but um, I'm not going to forget this either, okay, Phils? Like, y- you better make it up to us somehow this season. Right. If they, have a, if they have a bad season now, no. <laughs> if that happens because... Paul, <laughs> Paul, dude, <laughs> like, don't even like thinking that they're gonna have a bad season is like thinking that the fanatic used to be more closed minded. You know what I mean? Like it's doing the same thing to my brain. I know. Like, I'm like, Christine, I'm like pre angry that this is gonna be bad luck. Right. Right. And and now I'm angry that I said that out loud. Right. And I'm like getting upset again. So I'm sorry, well, I didn't mean to upset you. No, it's okay, I know. Um, well, thanks for making my day. <laughs> I mean, go Phils. Go Phils.